Hi, Tim here from Moraldo Sleeves. I'm just have to let me adjust this camera a little bit. I'll back over. I'm here for just getting a reading update. I know I haven't done one for a while, pup for like for over a week. I know that, but uh, uh, see, I've been having my my migraines have been acting up uh, quite a bit the last couple of weeks, and t I've had some where, except when I got up in the morning, I'd have a migraine, and t it would last all day. Uh, but enough with that. I'll show you what I've been reading. I have been doing some reading. Uh, anyway, I, there were some days with uh, migraines where I couldn't read, but I tried to anyway. First book. I'm reading is uh, The Keeper's Son by uh, Homer Hickam. He's a uh, guy that wrote uh, uh, that wrote uh, Rocket Boys, which uh, the movie October Sky is based on. But this uh, this is a work of fiction of his that uh, uh, that takes place at the outset of. Uh, the United States entering World War II. Uh, about uh, of a uh, boy, well, now he's a man that uh, he grew up on an island uh, of, of, of North Carolina, a small island, and uh, he had joined, gone to college, joined the Coast Guard, and uh, he would end up being stationed back at the, at the island that he was uh, born and raised on. And uh, that the people that are in the Coast Guard on that island are just natives to the island. And uh, they're not well trained or anything and uh, World War II starts and uh, they're keeping watch for U-boats uh, because in World War One that some submarines came close that came to around that area and that's all I'm, I'm going to say about that one mm -hmm. uh, I, well I'm uh, around uh, two-thirds of the way done with it uh, next uh, book I'm reading is uh, First Family by David Baldacci that's uh, uh, this is the fourth one in the uh, Sean King and uh, Shell Maxwell series, and uh, uh, there uh, 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 President's uh, sister-in-law is killed, and uh, her her daughter is kidnapped, and so uh, 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 Sean King's been friends with the uh, President and the First Lady long before. Uh, uh, that that the current president uh, uh, became president from when he was uh, like a senator or a congressman, and, uh, and so uh, so uh, they asked that uh, the first lady asked him to help out with, uh, uh, to uh, investigate the disappearance of her, uh, her niece and. Uh, and also the murder of her uh, sister-in-law, and uh, it's pretty good so far with that. And uh, I, I don't really want to get too far into it, or I don't really want to talk too much about it right now. I don't want to spoil it for anybody. Okay, and uh, then. Uh, the, the next one I'm reading is uh, on my Kindle. It's see if I can get a good shot of it. There. It's uh, by L. A. Starks. Thirteen Days of Pythagoras uh, Conspiracy. Well, well, her and I, we've been following it, each other, and uh, if I remember, right, we're friends on Goodreads. And uh, there's a group that we're both in uh, on Goodreads that uh, this is one of the books that uh, we're reading that started around September 15th going through through the 
end of this month and uh, she ha she asked me to uh, read it also what more and uh, it's about uh it's a thriller but it takes place like uh, in the world of oil refineries is the way I'm going to tell it. It's a uh, it's a Lynn Dayton thriller, but the first one, and uh, Lynn Dayton is a uh, high executive with, with the at an oil refinery. She's a uh, vice president for like the U.S. Op for the U.S. Uh, uh, operations uh, for, and uh, she have uh, got had convinced them to buy. I out uh, a refinery in Houston to you know, have that that combine and combining its operations with that of one that uh, the company already had there and uh, and uh, all of a sudden there's a accident a leak at the or hydrogen sulfides released which is a, a deadly gas that uh, can't be smelled and uh, Five people were killed from it, and uh, so she's investigating that. But uh, uh, during her investigation, she's uh, seen some uh, clues that look like it might be uh, that might not be an accident and that might have been sabotage, and uh, so she's trying to get to the bottom of that. And uh, I'm about to start. I'm starting it. I'll be starting it uh, uh, sometime tonight. I'll start reading uh, Dracula by Bram Stoker. It's uh, it, that's my current pub, uh, public domain read. Uh, that's why I can't show you it. That's one I downloaded from uh, Project Gutenberg. I'm reading it on my uh, Kindle Simple Touch. But uh, uh, that's my public domain read for now. And uh, Oh, and uh, see that uh, on the other books I told you about, First Family, I'm uh, over a third of the way done, um, but not quite uh, halfway done yet. And uh, uh, with the uh, 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 13 Days of uh, Pythagoras uh, Conspiracy, I'm uh, around uh, three quarters of the way done. The books I'll be starting when I finish shows uh, will be. Uh, Term Limits by Vince Flynn. Uh, uh, Tinker Taylor Sultras by, by John Licari. And Blood Sports by Dick Francis. Uh, see, those, see, I've been behind since, uh, got behind in July with uh, I, my group's uh, read along, so I'm trying to read them all. I, like, the first family is the first one for September's. Uh, and like I said, I'm getting along on it, and these other three, or the other three, four, so I hope I can read them in a uh, good time to, so I can get caught up this month. Oops. And then the other books I'll be reading this month after those will be Mary Higgins Clark, While My Pretty One Sleeps. David Baldacci, The Sixth Man. This is the uh, fifth book in the Sean King and Michelle Maxwell series. And uh, Cell by Stephen King, which is a uh, horror one. Those are the books other than Dracula that and, uh, were the people in, the, in my read-along group wanted to read this month. Well, that's all I have for you this time, so until next time, take it easy and keep on rocking.